Hey what's up everyone it's me Blake with another political video for you guys and this video is more of a response to a video I seen on someone by the name of Alex Jones. If you're into political news online and on the internet then you pretty much know who he is but basically if you note know, he's somebody who believes in conspiracy theories to a point where he believes everything is happens for a reason and he tries to make other people believe what he thinks is true. And if you believe against him and you believe that he's a complete moron for thinking of some of the things that he thinks, he just accuses you of being brainwashed by mainstream media and you know nothing. But the response was to his recent video that was that by the title of The Dark Knight Massacre was the ungun ban. Basically in this video he says that everything was set up just because there are a few new gun laws that are supposed to be passed within the next week or so. And that this massacre was set up so that this would ensure that these laws would happen. I honestly believe that this is a complete idiotic thing to assume that people would be murdered just so a law would definitely be passed. I mean for you to believe this there must be something wrong with you. I'm sorry but I truly believe that and you know what at first I was gonna give Alex Jones some props because when I seen this video I seen no AdSense on this on his video and I was like hey this guy you know he's making news about the tragic incident and I'm like you know what he's not really trying to benefit off it he's just giving off his opinion but then halfway through the video I noticed that he's just plugging his websites non-stop saying go here go here we talk about this we talk about that Alex Jones can honestly care less about this massacre and what really happened basically he's trying to make his own conspiracy so people would talk about him he'd get his name out there and for people you know, I idiotically would actually believe him, but in actuality, he just wants to promote himself and his websites. He can really care less, and he's making up the story that I really hope that even he does not believe. You know, he even goes on to saying that why was a six-year-old in the movie theater? Why not? I mean, granted, I am not a parent, so I don't know if I would personally take it, but as far as right now hearing the situation, if the six-year-old was there and there was no shooting, there would be no problem with it, stating how he also stated why Americans so obsessed with death and murder. Last time I checked, this was a Batman movie that I'm pretty sure you've seen all the Batman movies released to date, and I'm pretty sure you even read a couple comic books. People seem to be forgetting that. To think that some strange tie-in was the movie was all about conspiracy, it was a Batman movie, people. Let's be realistic. Now, in the idiotic thing, are some people are saying, you know, if their guns were legal, then guns in the seats could have guns and they could have shot back and protected themselves. Are you serious? So let's have an all-out shootout because guns are legal and people, regular people on the streets can carry guns. And when they would have just had a grand old shootout and everybody would have got shot in there. And the fact that people think that if you had a gun in that theater, you could have saved yourself and killed that guy. Do you realize that that guy went in there with gas bombs, a bulletproof vest on, you seriously think that you, an uh, average person, is carrying a gun would have killed this guy who act, who obviously knew what he was doing? I highly doubt it. Let people, seriously, you need to wake up yourselves and stop allowing yourself to be brainwashed by these people who are conspiracists and who believe stuff like this, like such as Alex Jones. Everyone have your own opinion and don't let these type of people make you think of these ridiculous rumors and stories. But that's just my opinion, and hopefully uh, uh, quite a few people believe with me and don't all side with this Alex Jones character. But it's me, Blake, with another video for you guys. Let me know what you think, guys think of the situation, and in particular, if you want to check out his video, maybe you'll find it quite humorous as well, just like I did, because I think it was a joke. Make sure to subscribe. Until next time, it's me, Blake. Peace.